Meds clear make your concepts clear. Welcome to my channel. Don't forget to subscribe. Let's discuss the vital signs. What exactly are the vital signs? It is the basic monitoring signs that is monitored by the healthcare professionals, which are temperature, pulse rate, respiratory rate, and blood pressure. BP. You can easily remember it by TPRBP. Let's get into these vitals briefly. So what is temperature? It is the degree of hotness or coldness. The normal range is 37 degrees Celsius or 98.6 Fahrenheit. It depends on which scale you measures. There are several measuring sites for temperature, but the common ones are 1. Sublingual. By placing the thermometer under the tongue in the sublingual pouch. 2. Axillary. By placing the thermometer in your armpit. This site is mostly used in the healthcare settings. 3. Temporal. Can measure the temperature from the auditory canal. 4. Rectal. This site gives the most accurate temperature. Now move towards the second vital sign which is pulse rate. Here comes the question that what exactly is pulse rate? It is the number of times our heart beats in a minute. The normal heart rate, or pulse rate is 60 to 100 beats per minute. If the heart beats less than 60 beats per minute then it is called bradycardia. And when the heart rate increases to more than 100 beats per minute then it is called tachycardia. Heart rates varies among individual. You can stop the video and note it down. One important thing to remember is that infants and neonates heart rate are higher which is up to 140 beats per minute because of the circulation required for their rapid growth. Let's talk about the respiratory rate. It is the number of breaths taken per minute. The normal range is 12 to 20 breaths per minute. When the respiratory rate decreases below 12 breaths per minute then it is called bradypnea. And respiratory rate greater than 20 breaths per minute is defined as tachypnea. So what does apnea means? The letter A in the apnea means absence. Therefore, apnea means cessation of breathing for 15 seconds. Just like the heart rate, respiratory rate also varies among individual. Now discuss blood pressure or BP. It is the force of circulating blood on the walls of arteries, especially arterioles. There are two types of BP. One is systolic, which is the pressure of the blood during contraction of the heart, and the other one is diastolic, which is the pressure of the blood during relaxation of heart. Our normal BP is 120 over 80, where 120 is the systolic blood pressure and 80 is the diastolic blood pressure. The blood pressure when decreases to 90 over 60, it is called as hypotension. And when the BP increases to above the normal range, it is called as hypertension. According to American Health Association, these are the stages of hypertension.